Suicide. Round over. Hello guys, it's Crazy Man 7777 here, and we are with an exciting thing. The World of Tanks on Xbox One Beta has just opened up for absolutely no reason. So as you guys know, the World of Tanks Xbox One Beta is supposed to start from 2 a.m. in the morning tomorrow to 2 a.m. in the morning on Monday. But for some unknown and completely awesome reason, you can connect. So, we're going to be looking at everything, just everything, and hopefully this isn't too low of a quality. Hopefully I changed my voice to a little bit not loud. There's going to be some background noise. But it's just super exciting, guys. It's really super exciting. I am very, very excited. I don't really know why the world that the beta just opened up today, but it did. It's beautiful. It really is beautiful. So everything is already set up for Xbox One controllers, which is completely awesome. Um... The graphics just astounding. Definitely better than a computer version by far. And now we actually have in the garage. It looks like we have three different three different views than we did in the Xbox version, uh, Xbox 360 version. We have uh, wide open, mid, and close, which is something I just discovered this very second. So every single tank, unlike the computer version has been converted into HD awesomeness. It's just beautiful. Uh, there's new engine effects. It looks way more like the pollution that people would be putting out in the 1940s, 50s. Uh, the garage is apparently the premium garage for World Tanks Xbox regular. And we have all kinds of mysterious tanks uh, sitting around in this place. Just want to look at all of the different beautiful things that we have. Ooh, oh man, that's just magic. Look at that. Ah, uh, it's beautiful. It really is. Oh man, that gun. That gun looks so much better. Oh. And if you guys remember, there was actually a super weird glitch where, like, on Xbox 360 version, when you went to this view. You actually, it would actually cut off the gun, but now you get to look in it. Oh, that's beautiful. Look at that. Oh, that's just awesome. And even the little pictures at the bottom have been updated. I just want to look at the barrels of these guns. Oh, that's cool. It's beautiful, beautiful. And I've downloaded the Founders Pack, which is supposed to give me the T-E6X. Which, uh, not seem to be in here for some reason. Here, I'll, I'll show you guys. So, right now, it's only available in a bundle on the store. With, here, we'll look at it. With this right here, which is the beta tank. I can view the details right here. Yes. So this gives you the T1E6X1, or the T1E6X as we like to call it, as well as a founder Xbox One founder emblem. I don't think you're supposed to get that until after the beta, so I guess we'll see. Man, the Cromwell looks so much better. Oh man, E100 is really one I want to look at though. Just look at this thing. Oh, it's just beautiful. It's beautiful. Hey look, someone wants to set someone else on fire. I don't know if you guys heard that, but that's kind of funny. Alright. Ooh, I can, no, the gun isn't really long enough for that. Alright. So, 
I guess uh, we're going to look at all of the other features that we have sitting around. Oh, look, those tracks. Yes, as far as I know, the tracks are now individualized pieces. Ooh, look at that. Oh, I can zoom in. That's cool. Oh man, they have like little. You can see the or guns in there. In their helmets and their packs and all that. Oh, that's so cool. This is just. This is just too good, guys. It's too good. All right, so we're gonna look at tanks that are available. Oh, shut up! It's gonna give me all the stupid tutorials. I don't believe that there's any more than the yeah, there isn't any. Yeah, there's, there's not. As far as I know, there shouldn't be any more than the regular version of old tanks. They were supposed to finish off all the lines, but apparently they didn't do it. Something that I was hoping that they would do, which apparently they didn't do, is the feature of World Warships that is available and in Blitz that I actually liked where you could look at the tanks that you don't have. Thankfully, my Xbox One is awesome and it puts out all kinds of beautiful... Huh. Apparently I had that activated. Please deactivate and off. Anyway, uh, the Xbox One will put out 1080p 60 frames per second without me having to have a TV that can handle that. So, right now, basically I'm telling you that I have a TV that can't handle that. Tuning, team training. I wonder how I invite people. Alright. See, the real question is if I can invite people that are playing... Oh, Spider-Man. Oh, never mind. If I can do invite people. Yeah, I don't have enough people online right now. Look at that. Nothing. Nothing. Tank practice. There's supposed to be a PvE mode. Tier 1 through 10, I'm mean, using Malnoka. No, they changed the maps. It's Malnoka now. Well, there is supposed to be a PvE mode, but apparently that's not ready yet. It's like supposed to be a whole players versus enemies mode. Should be interesting to check out. So, I guess that's my World Tanks Tuesday on Friday for you guys for this week. I really hope that you check this video out. It is beautiful and delicious. All those things in between. And I will see you guys next time, maybe over the weekend, with some more features of Xbox One version. See ya!